Dude, L10. No, L10. L10. Elton! What's up everybody and guys before we get into the finale of the Blair Witch Project video Which by the way everyone in the comment section should maybe maybe tone it down a little bit I got like 15,000 hate comments uh, If you know me well enough, I would never actually be an a-hole to any of my friends But my job is to make really good videos So maybe watch to the end and it'll all make sense what happened in that video But before we get to that I want to make an announcement right now that is incredibly important to me, something I've been working on for a while, and I think will be equally as incredibly important to all of you. If you guys don't know, I have the clothing company Senate Society, which is a not-for-profit clothing company. We're not legally non-profit, but 100% of the proceeds that the company makes goes back to other non-profits, charities, organizations, and groups. We found a way that can offer jobs to literally all of you. So if you're watching this right now or listening to it, whatever it is, we can offer you guys a job, like a minimum wage job where you can make probably another 600 bucks a month if you guys want on top of whatever it is. And we have a fundraising program. But before I give you more details, I want to bring in the person that's helping me make all this happen. This is Ginger, everyone. Uh, this is my girlfriend. Uh, that's not the point of this video. But she's the one who helped me build a website, design the program, everything. She's also the one that will be answering all your emails. So don't be a dick to my girlfriend. There's two different things. So if you guys are in need of some extra revenue, Here's how it works. You might have seen before that there's other companies that have like affiliate programs where people post codes and they're like, use my discount code, right? That person makes money every time their code gets used. It's not really that much. So we kind of figured out what's the absolute most we can offer back to people. And we now have the highest commission rate that the industry has ever seen. So with that being said, if you guys are 16 years or older and you want to make some extra money promoting Senate Society to your friends, to your family, to your school, to the, the mall, whatever it is, we're gonna give you back a percentage of everything that you help sell. And then of course, the remainder of what you help sell goes to other nonprofits. So the math that we've worked out is that basically, if you sell like 20 items a week, you can make 600 bucks a month extra for yourself. So that program is on the website. That's all in the description. It's all there. We want you guys to check it out. We're really hoping that a couple hundred of you could help you know, use the extra income. And additionally, we have a fundraising program. We're 100% of the proceeds from what you sell will go back to your cause. So if you're in like a, a football team or an arts class or a music class or a church group or whatever it is and you're looking for extra funding and you don't want to sell candy or candles or mattresses or anything like that, you guys can actually promote Senate Society and we will give you back 100% of the proceeds from whatever you sell. So same thing, we've worked it out where if you can get like 100 orders, you guys end up making about $2,500 to $3,000 for your cause. So we just wanted to take time to let you guys know about all that. Am I missing anything before I wrap up? No, you got it all. Fucking don't even need her, guys. Killing it. <laughs> <laughs> so, so that's kind of everything. We want you guys to know about that. We tried to find a way that we think is a really positive clothing company that you guys can all push and support. Make some extra money wherever you are. By the way, right now it's USA only. Stay tuned. We're going to try and push it international. It's kind of complicated with taxes. Really looking forward to helping utilize this to help you guys raise as much money as you can. And of course, if you guys just want to buy some gear, go over there and check it out. This is a long uh, thing, but we've been working on this for a while, trying to figure it out. I'm going to put a little recap video for the Blair Witch last one, and then the finale. Uh, that's coming up right now. And then also, keep in mind, a bunch of really fun overnights that are coming up. One of which is the fact that I rented out the entire Queen Mary for the night. <laughs> okay, bye. Enjoy the video. Bye! Do it. Oh my, oh my god. god! I'm like frozen in shock right now. I, I, have, I have no idea what's about to happen. Dear Lord, please protect this. Keep it safe. Oh, whoa. Dude, I'm, I'm just feeling off. Something's watching us, Evan. This isn't like hard to breathe. Something coming towards us. There's... Corbin, get the back here. What are you doing? Corbin, what do you want to do? We really, we're doing this again? Really, just not talking. What the fuck are you doing, Corbin? You want to turn your flashlight on? You're just gonna stand there like a weirdo. Corbin. Lost. I don't know where we are. Where's the meeting point? Do you know? No. Should we just head back to the car? Yes. Okay. I mean, this is the road we took, right? The path. I think so. I don't know. Let's just start going. Come on, let's go. What were those eyes? I have no fucking clue, dude. Corbin. Corbin, are we...
are we really doing this? You're really gonna make me come over here? Oh my god, fuck everybody, bro. What the fuck? Why would you fucking do that? Oh my god. Sounded like a fucking bear. <laughs> feel my heart right now. No, 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 Evan, feel my fucking heart right now. Yeah, it's going. Oh my god. Why the fuck would you guys do that? That Sorry, is not funny. Oh Feel my, my heart. God, oh my god. Feel my heart. I'm, <laughs> I'm not even playing. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> oh my god. Why you did you do that? Dude, that was so good. <laughs> that was so good, man. That was you so good. What the fuck's going on right now? Oh. Oh, you man. guys just scared me. <laughs> oh man. Why are y'all so happy? Jesus. Oh, do you like have any idea where we are? Fucking what? <laughs> What's it fucking called? The Blair? Black Hills Forest. Yeah. The Blair Witch Forest. Yeah. The Blair Witch. Yeah. Which was a novel written by a person, based off of about, a fiction. Based off of a fiction book. About this place though, that's haunted. Based off of a fiction book, which is a made-up forest. The movie is based on a book. That was has, this all a fucking prank? None of this is real. What the fuck? We just drove 400 miles to Maryland for this, Corey. But whatever creature oh over there, that God. probably is real. Just <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't want to go over there then. What oh, the? Man. Wait, you guys were everybody? Was so good. Yeah, it was so good. I'm sorry. Yeah. Everybody was fucking <laughs> in on it. Everyone knew. Yeah, that that, that, that board dude. that board I broke. Yeah, it was like off Amazon. It was like forty dollars. I so told you in the lighthouse. It was like like some crate. No, we all knew that this was. What 40. the fuck? <laughs> How long have you guys fucking known that he was gonna do this to me? I mean, literally before the light. Like, why do you think I never brought Dude. the board back out again? Why? Do Don't you think, think I would use it? Real quick, why do you think I would ever let him write my name <laughs> on a board? Like, are you serious? Right? Dude, I was holding the camera right on top of him. Are you serious? Dude, <laughs> he didn't even try and make him. me not Corey, spell it. Yeah. Corey, wh why was I okay with just going with him? <laughs> <laughs> Separating I don't know. everyone. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh. Come on, dude. Y'all just scared the fuck out of me. Six <laughs> nights of this. You don't think I'm going to have a little fun at one point? Jesus. No! I thought this was a scary fucking trip. <laughs> nah, <laughs> hey, let's prank Corey. Let's make Corey move his pants. <laughs> Let's act like a bear and tackle him. Wait, why are you so wet? You, oh, why are you guys both so oh, wet? Man. We fucking <laughs> fell into a big ass pond. <laughs> feet. No, 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 you don't understand. We're fucking oh, running because we see the fucking eyes again. This shit's fucking uh, like moving. Okay? Wait, what? No, we fucking... The thing you dragged us all the way out there to see that wasn't there? Then there's made you run into a river? No, there's something actually there. Yeah. So I if we go apparently. running into the trees, we immediately both <laughs> fall into this fucking pond up to here. And when I tell you, probably five feet in front of us is a 50 foot drop. No sarcasm. Jesus Christ. 50 wow. feet? Yeah. 50 feet? Yes. Is okay, there maybe, a... 40. <laughs> <laughs> maybe 40. Maybe 40. His camera! I couldn't tell. It was his, almost done. His camera's dry. Yeah, his camera. My shoes aren't. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, oh. I'm soaked up to my knees. <laughs> Jeez, man. Man, y'all suck, bro. <laughs> it's too good, bro. By the way, I just gotta say to all the viewers that are watching that, 
uh, shout out to Aaron and Corbin, wherever they are, for, uh, for that right phenomenal back. acting that it required. Because ultimately, you know, we got you guys too. So, <laughs> uh, so I'm just going to say, I feel like that was well executed. I'm going to give you a high five. Well executed. You. High five. Boom. Bomba. High five. Sorry about the shoes. It's okay. High five. Thank you. Sorry about... <laughs> 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 oh, I am the prank right. king. Thank you for the. <laughs> Dude, can we fucking leave? Yeah, yeah, we should. <laughs> That's right. a good we should because our flight is very soon. Yeah. All right. Well, one, sorry uh, for doing that, and also thank you guys for watching the video and tuning into this whole road trip. Thanks to Corbin for being a, a good sport right now. I think he kind of has to, otherwise he's not getting the airport. Uh, <laughs> My shoes are soaked. <laughs> oh, I can't walk to the I will. I will buy you oh new shoes. God. Do Our we have time? Do we have time to get shoes? Probably mm. not. But you, I'll buy you guys new shoes, okay? It's I want off whites. <laughs> <laughs> off whites. Under to under $100. Awesome. We have one more coming up that we're going to do back home somewhere in a place in Long Beach. Make sure, of course, to check out Corey and Aaron's channel. Uh, they do a lot more paranormal videos. Corbin, of course. And if you want to show Evan some love, you know, he goes underappreciated. Um, so, thank you guys. <laughs> and we'll see you next time. Bye. Uh.